Hello everybody, my name is Slow Pace with Rapids Infinite, and today guys, I am going to show you the top three free Minecraft hosting servers. So if you do enjoy this video, remember to leave a like, hit that subscribe button as well if you are new to the channel, I'd really appreciate that. Before I get into it too much, I'll quickly want to say as well that if you want to know how to play Minecraft with your friends, there will be a video link in the description below. And there's also a link in the description on how to install Octavine and mods and forage if you want to know how to do all that as well. Anyway, I'm not going to do any more talking, I'll get straight into the video. So coming up free spot guys, we have Atanoz. See, this is a free Minecraft server hosting. See, all you got to do to get started is actually click on the link in the description below and click on the little play button in the corner. Now, if you don't have an account, all you got to do is click sign up, choose a username, and then click on next and make sure you do agree to the terms. And from here, all you got to do is choose a password, repeat the password, and put an email in there if you want to that is optional but i would recommend doing that then once you put all that in just click sign up then once you click sign up it will tell you to create a server so click on the big blue button it says that and from here you can see your ip at the top make sure you copy that and also you can choose java edition or bedrock edition as well from there and then click on create so now you are on the main dashboard so what i do is click accept all to the visit website so yeah make sure you click accept on that and now here it is this is the main dashboard now from here you can see your server is offline also you've got your ip as well and also your start button make sure you click on that and make sure you accept the eula and then click ok as well on here or you can click cancel it's really up to you now you are in a queue so you've got to wait it shouldn't take too long so make sure you click confirm now because if you don't click that your server will shut down so yeah, make sure you click that and now your server is pending now, as you can see the server is in 1.16.3 it's filling a minecraft and it holds up to 20 players now you can change all this in the uh, server files and also make sure you click on the ip at the top as well copy that because you're going to need that to join your minecraft server now just wait for your server to load up it can take a little while sometimes depends how many people are on the server and also we are creating this server up for the first time as well so it should take a lot quicker next time you start it up now make sure you copy your ip because you're going to need this to join your minecraft server so shortly your server should say online once it says online you can actually join your minecraft server now go over to our minecraft click on multiplayer click on add server in the server address put in that ip i told you to copy and click done now you can actually join your minecraft server by double clicking on it now you're on your minecraft world so yeah just give your friends the ip and they can join also so yeah, this is how you set up a minecraft server on atanods this is a number three spot we should go straight into number two spot so number two spot guys we have server.pro so yeah, there will be a link in the description as well to this one make sure you click on that now once you are here make sure you scroll right to the bottom of the page and click create a free server now from here click on the top one that says zero dollars a month or zero dollars an hour right there then scroll down a bit and make sure you select a location now i'm going to select canada because it's, it will be in english then from there scroll down again and click on game you can choose minecraft java edition there's a few other ones on there as well you can click on but if you're doing it for minecraft java edition make sure you click on that one also the type i'm going to put vanilla minecraft but i think you can also do like mods as well uh spigot and stuff like that as well minecraft version i'm going to put 1.16.3 you can do any other minecraft version you want now your host name you can this is your ip for your minecraft server so i'm going to put slow pays and make sure you choose the end part of your server as well as you see i've just swapped mine over and if you have not got an account make sure you actually sign up or log in if you've got an account already now once you've done that click sign up and now you have to activate your account so just go over to your gmail your outlook account and log into that and they should send you an email and you got to confirm your email address once you confirm your email address it'll take you straight back over to server.pro all you've got to do is scroll right to the bottom and then click create server now you will be in a queue so you just wait for this queue it takes pretty quick it all depends on how many people are on it then make sure you click start server now your server is offline at this moment so as you see it's in 1.16.3 the minecraft version there is your ip as well your host name is your ip so make sure you click that and copy it that is how you're going to join your minecraft server so as you see up in the corner here it says power on the green button make sure you click on that to power up your minecraft server now this can take a little while because it's got to create all the files for your minecraft server so just be patient here now if you want to watch your minecraft server being created just click over on console and it should tell you when your server is ready to join so once it says done 
now you can actually join back onto your Minecraft server. So go over to Minecraft and click on multiplayer, click on add server, server address, put in that IP address I told you to copy, click done and double click onto your Minecraft server. Now this is how you create a Minecraft server on server.pro. So yeah, just make sure you give your friends the IP to join this one as well. So yeah, this is it for number two spot. We should go into number one spot. So in number one spot, guys, we have Minecraft hosting.pro. So yeah, straight from here, click the link in the description, go over to their website, click on free man. And then once you click on free man, just scroll down, select the location you'd like to stay at or for your server host to be at. Then come down even further, put a host name in there. I'm going to put slow pays once again. This is your IP address. This is how you join your Minecraft server. Now scroll down a little bit more, you can select Java edition. So vanilla Minecraft, you can have Forage, Spigot. So just click on whichever one you want and click on the version. I'm done 1.16.3. Now this is a free trial for 10 days. So make sure you select on 10 days. This is all the stuff you will get, all the features and stuff and all the options. And you see it is zero dollars. Also, you have to create an account because this will not work. So make sure you do click sign up or log in if you have an account already. Now once you've signed up, all you got to do is click on order. As you see, your server is there waiting for you. So you got to do is click on checkout. Make sure you do agree to their terms of service as well. Now you've got to wait for your server to be installed. So you just wait a little while. This shouldn't take too long. And also you can have multiple servers. So you can have one server for your friends. You have another server for public. You can create up to five servers with this Minecraft server hosting. So once it's all installed, you should take it to the other page just like this one. All you've got to do is click on the blue button where I'm hovering over right now to start up your Minecraft server. Also, you can put a texture pack in here. You can put the world name, what Java edition, game mode, difficulty as well, max players. Also, you could do like mods as well. You can allow PVP, uh, spawn mobs, spawn animals. You can do all sorts of here. You can change the uh, Minecraft version as well. So make sure you click on save changes and now click on the blue, the blue button right there as you see the server will be loading as you can see as well just below it you can see server address as you see mine is slow pays so make sure you copy that and actually put that into your minecraft server also you can load up your console as well from here all you got to do is click on the console button right there and it's load up your console and then you can see when your world is installed so yeah as you can see there's server address as well right beside it as you see, mine is slow pays. So you make sure you do copy that because that you're going to need that to join your Minecraft server. So now what we've got to do is go straight over to your Minecraft multiplayer, click on add server, server address, put in your Minecraft server IP, then click done, then join your Minecraft server. Now this is how you join your Minecraft server and how to set it up on Minecraft hosting.pro. And make sure you give your friends the IP as well so you can make them join. So yeah, this is how you set up Minecraft server and they're all for free as well. Now, to get a fully 24 seven server, there is no way you can get it for free. So you are gonna have to pay for a Minecraft server. Now, there are very, very cheap servers out there that you can get one for $2.50 a month, which is dead cheap for a Minecraft server. If you wanna know how to get that, make sure you check out my other video. I think it's called how to play with your friends on Minecraft. So there will be a link in the description below. And on there, I show you how to get a $2 monthly server and that one is 24 7 fully so yeah anyway guys i hope you all enjoyed this video if you did remember to leave a like hit that subscribe button if you are new to this channel and i'll see you guys all next time peace out